Dan Walker was hit by a car and flung from his bike in an accident that left the Channel 5 News presenter knocked out for 25 minutes. Lorraine Kelly has since reacted to the news as she offered some kind words to the former BBC Breakfast presenter. It comes after Dan, 45 shared a series of shocking images of his bloodied face following the horrific accident. Taking to Twitter today, Lorraine reacted to Don's post after he caused a stir on social media when he advised others to wear a helmet when taking to the roads. He penned, it's odd to get lectured by people telling me that bike helmets aren't important when the emergency services at the scene yesterday told me I probably wouldn't be here if I wasn't wearing one. Funny old world. I hope you're having a good Tuesday. Soup through a straw for lunch. In view of her 737,000 followers, Lorraine wrote, Hope you are okay Dan, very scary. Video footage has since emerged of the accident where the broadcaster could have admittedly been crushed. The ex-BBC presenter said he was lucky to be alive and has since revealed he may require surgery. In footage obtained by The Sun, the Strictly star can be seen on his electric bike as he headed to the train station. He enters the roundabout in Sheffield and is following it around when the presenter and a car collide while his bike is crushed. The dad of three was covered in blood and was unconscious until police and the parademics arrived. He told the publication, I thought I was a goner, to be honest. I came round with paramedics and police standing over me on the other side of the roundabout. Victoria Beckham calls David a tosser as fans slam her pancake error latest Vanessa Feltz feels bruised as ex-fan sends message on her birthday admission Piers Morgan slams police for intrusion into Nicola Bully's life column, the Channel 5 news presenter admitted he has zero recollection of the accident. Dan said, I just remember being at the junction, seeing a big gap and then I woke up. I haven't seen what happened and I'm not sure I'd want to put things in my head that aren't there. He finished by saying my face is a proper mess as he took to social media on Monday and showed his injuries that included a black eye and swollen face. In a lengthy message, he penned, blown away by all the lovely messages. Thank you. Just got home from hospital. Battered and bruised but, amazingly, nothing broken. Very thankful to still be here. I have no memory of anything and just remember coming round on the tarmac with paramedics and police around me. Thanks for all your kindness. Jamie and Sean were so great in the ambulance, not sure I was making much sense.